Okay, what's up guys? So, this is a video that I've been meaning to do for a while now, and I kept forgetting. Like, I just kept forgetting to do this video, and I'm like, bro, if I get any Forza game, I have to do this video. So, show? So, I will be showing, okay? Why do you do that? I will be showing off the cars that I got in my garage, and I'm going to try to make it a quick video. I don't want it to be super, super long, but anyways... Okay, starting off with my favorite car, alright? The uh, Trailcat 2016 Jeep. Yeah, I modified um, this, so it's uh, it's pretty fast. It is pretty fast. Why won't... Oh, so yeah, oh, so you can't... So you just gotta do that, okay. You just gotta move the button, because I'm like, they ain't showing what I want to look at. But, yeah, over a thousand horsepowers, okay? Um, that's, that's what I mainly pay attention to. Uh, torque and weight and fro, um, and fro, all that stuff. Like, it's, you know, I'm still, I'm still learning a little bit. Then I got a Javelin AMX. Yeah, I, uh, I don't know. I wish you could, like, look at them and things, but anyways... And uh, Nomad 2016 Ari Ariel, Ariel. Oh, I think that's like one of them, like um, those like Doom buggies and stuff. But anyways, then I got a couple of Ashton Martins V12 Vantage S, DB DB4 GT Zagato. I don't usually drive the Ashton Martins. I should drive it one of these days. I should maybe after this video like suit one up. And it's already at S1. Dang, it's rear wheel drive. I only had 500 horsepowers? Dang. I feel like it should have more than that. But I don't know. I do not know. Anyways, moving on. In Audi, I got a couple of Audis. In R S3 Sportsback. I don't like that. I don't know. I don't, I don't like that. And Sports Quat Quattro Quattro. Made in 1983. Okay. Nice look, too. I think I've seen people with Audi, but I don't know if it's that exact one. But it might be, and I'm just not paying attention and stuff. All right. Moving on to BMWs and i8. I had to get an i8 because uh, if uh, you guys are a fan of the uh, rapper Tentacion, he had a BMW i8. So, yeah, it's um, after his uh, tragic passing, I was like, nah, I had to get one in memory of him and stuff so i think i'll probably just do that anytime i do get a racing game go and get in uh bmw i8 but anyways i don't know because i think then they say he had a roadster and it's like the roadster i think comes with the dlc but i got this one because i'm like listen they both look alike so anyways then in uh bmw m5 a z3 m coupe and, uh, got Camaro. I made that. This one I made for a friend. I'm probably going to make another one. Well, I can just use this one just with the still the paint job and stuff. It won't be a difference. I'm like, yeah, I ain't trying to waste money. So anyways, yeah, this is a Camaro I made for a friend of mine. She has a Camaro. She's a real big fan of Camaro. So I made like a little special video for her and uh, showing off this Camaro. I like it. I like the side of it. I'm like, if it was something like that, I'm like, nah, I had to, like, high-five. If I seen a Camaro like this in real life, even with the name side, I'm like, nah, you deserve a high-five and a hug, my friend. But anyways, then a Z28, then a 1953 Corvette. Dang. I'm going to have to test that out on the road. That's what I am going to have to do. Then then uh, I, I do not like Dodge Vipers. I think it was in Forza 3. When I was driving a Dodge Viper and I did not like that car. Or was it? Yeah, I think it was Forza 3. Yeah, I just don't like the Dodge Vipers and things. Maybe this one might be different, but I don't know. Uh, rear wheel in the um, case. There was a rear wheel drive car and I don't usually do so well with those cars. But um, yeah, I just I don't know. I don't like Dodge Vipers. Now I got a Charger RT, a Dart Hemi Super Stock. I don't usually drive this car, but I feel like I've always had this car in every Forza game that I've ever played. Like, they always give me this car, or it's like, if they do have it where you, they just give you cars. This, because this car is, was given to me. I, I did not go out and buy this and things, so, yeah, it's like, I, all, I always see this car and I never drive it. I need to drive it and see what it sounds like, but moving on, 
Got a Mustang. Of course, I had to get a Mustang. I feel like that's like the go-to car. I have to buy like a Mustang and then an um an uh, Kona Seg. If I don't if I don't have those two cars in the racing game, then I'm like, there ain't no reason for me to play that racing game. If they don't have a Mustang and a Kona Seg in the racing game, is that re even a racing game? Like it's no. Nah, come on now. Then uh yeah, I think for a while I was driving the Ford F one fifty Raptor. I haven't driven that car in a while. I think I remember I was driving it a lot in the snow when I had came across the snow in this game for the first time. Then an uh, Escort. I got a couple of Escorts. Well, it's like an older one. I've never driven that car either. Dang, only 130 horsepower? Well, I mean, it ain't really a muscle-like car and stuff. Front-wheel drive? I got to drive that and see how that's like. An RS200 Evolution... Another Escort, an RS. That, that, that one was a turbo. This is the RX 1600. Then this one, I think I it's a barn find. I think, yeah, this GT40 MKI. Yeah, I think that was a barn find. So uh, I think a few of these cars was a barn find. I think that Jaguar was a barn find too. But uh, this was, I don't think, I think, no, I think this was given to me. I think when I did one of them wheels, I think this was given to me. Uh, Holden, an HQ, Monaro. Or Monaro, whatever you, um, um, uh, tomato, tomato, GT, GTS 350, it looks nice, I'll drive it, uh, then this, uh, this Jaguar, yeah, I think I've gotten this, um, I think all these Jaguars I might have gotten in a wheel spin or a barn find or something, but, yeah, XJ220, XJS, and the E-Type S1, and then, of course, my Kona Seg, I had to get it. I had to get a Kona Seg. Like, what am I doing if I don't have a Kona Seg, okay? Like, it's, come on now. You you have to have a Kona Seg if you have a racing game. But then, of course, a couple of Lamborghinis. I really do actually live, um, love the Lamborghini truck. Like, it's, if this was given to me in real life, I'm like, bro, not only is it a Lamborghini, but it's a Lamborghini truck. So it's like, yeah, the, um, the Huracan, Huracan. LP 1604 and then the Euros concept. Yeah, this is like, and I don't even think they really made that many trucks. I think they're, I think they did make a truck in the 80s, but it didn't do so good. So um, they just, they just like, I think they discontinued those uh, Lamborghini trucks. I think it was Lamborghini, and um, then uh, yeah, it was. Uh, then they came out with one in 2014 and stuff. I think I remember when they were talking about it too, but. I don't know. They've talked about so many cars. I can't even follow up with cars nowadays. Like, I'm so behind in, like, Mustang videos and cars and all that stuff. But anyways, moving on. An 037 Strad Straddle 1982 Lancia. Huh. Have I driven that before? It's pretty good, actually. It's an um, A-class car, and it's epic, too. Huh. Retro rally. Oh, they mean to do that. No, wait a second. Oh, okay, that's just what it is. Okay, okay. Oh, stats is good, too. I should have been looking at the stats, but I wasn't. But anyways, um, yeah, I think both of these was given to me and stuff. Yeah, I, was, I think I might have been doing, like, one of those wheel spins things, and they gave they gave me these cars. But, uh, yeah, Range Rover, uh, 1973, the Series 3, Forza Edition. Huh. I'll have to test that and see what that's like. What's what's them horsepowers like though? Six thirteen, huh? That's actually pretty good. I, that's crazy how this is legendary. It don't even really seem like it's all that fast. I got it like no. Nah, if I soup it up, they'll probably be fast. Then uh, I modded this car out because I was seeing people using this car doing three hundred and stuff, and uh, like it's like beating speeds and things. Like I don't even understand how that's even possible, but. People have done it, and I'm like, I, I need to see. I need to see some YouTube videos or something. But anyways, yeah. Uh, 2011 Lotus Evera S. Then a S, um, E Spirit, S Sprit, S Sprit V8. I, that's what I'm guessing it might be called. Then a, um, else an else LC GT1. I don't know these names, man. I'm sorry, but I just, I just don't know. I just don't know. And an MG, a 1966 MG, MGB GT. That's just way too many letters, man. Y'all should have came up with a better name for that. But anyways, um, yo, I might have to give me some uh, GTRs. I know I was a, um, I really do like the uh, GTR from the, I think it was Furious 7. 
it was like towards the end that gtr was really nice so i'm like nah i had to i have to see about that one but anyways a skyline gtr v spec 2 moving on then you driving this car the car only got three wheels 1962 um pill peel p50 yeah this car is just you can't drive it i tried but you just can't do it all right so i'll try i'll try to test it out one of these days but yeah it's our right, try to test it out again but it's just it's undrivable can't do it but anyways um yeah i think another dune buggy car 2015 polaris rz uh, rzr xp 1000 eps see it's like just that's doing too much man the 1987 pontiac Firebird trans am gta yo i wanted yeah i wanted a um like a pontiac car no or no wait a minute never mind that's a different car never mind never mind i was thinking of a plymouth but uh nope yep never mind just never mind moving on um porsche cars yo listen all right because i don't like porsche cars in real life i just think way then i didn't hear way too many stories like i think three celebrities they didn't die in porsche cars i think it was um yeah it was like james dean that um it was like an actor in the 60s or something and there's like he died in one of those porsche cars and i think it was ryan dunn uh from the mtv show uh jackass he died in one of those Porsche cars. And then uh, Paul Walker. And I'm like, listen, me and Porsche cars, like, they just, they just seems like that they'd be having just problems and stuff. Like, you just hear too many stories with Porsche cars and stuff. And I'm like, nah, I, um, it ain't my thing. It ain't my thing. But anyways, uh, um, uh, see a can, can, something turbo, the, these words, man, K-Man GTS uh 911 gt3 911 carrera rs they're nice looking cars beautiful looking cars and stuff but it's just i don't know you just hear too many stories like if this is a car given to me in real life i'll probably be all like listen you know um the thought of giving me a gift is amazing but this is just i don't know like i'm kind of like mentally scarred with just the porsche name so Y'all come out with the car is guaranteed not to just um, lose control, blow up, or explode in things. And yeah, I mean, all cars do that, but you just hear it with a lot of Porsche cars. I see people driving Porsche cars. I'm like, yo, your cars are nice and all, but I just won't drive it. I don't want to be a passenger in it. But anyways, moving on. An, uh, 2015 Radical RXC Turbo. Huh, pretty fast, actually. Stats is on. Or did I stock this out? I might, well, or, I don't remember doing that. Dang, if this is already an S2 class car, and it's almost like, and it's like, max, um, like, braking is good. Oh, this must be like one of them, like, formula cars, because I'm like, if braking is at a 10, I'm like, dang, maybe I should have been driving this car. I might have to drive this car afterwards. But anyways, moving on. Uh, then you go, okay, got some Rams. That's weird, you don't have them in the Dodge section. Well, I, well... I don't know. I, I don't know. I do not know. They gave me two of the same cars. So than the other one. But that one's new. I wish you could like... Can you sell cars? Remove car from garage. You sure you want to see? Then it's like, yo, no. Ah, come on. I ain't want to good. I ain't want to do that. I ain't want to go back that far. But see, it's like I don't know if you can sell cars in here because I would straight up sell these cars, man. Just get me some credit. But I don't know if you can, so I ain't gonna fool with it. So I ain't gonna remove a car and it's like you know, you know, it doesn't do anything for me. So, anyways, moving on. Uh, 1993 Renan Renault Renault Cleo on Williams. That's a name. That ain't no car. That's a they, they giving cars like human. Name. I don't. I don't know. I do not know. Like you see like names like a a, a Spitfire, and then you get this name where it's like no. Nah, it's like I I made these cars just so I could give it like my like. This is like the whoever came up with this. Like you have like a manufactured like car name. You know, like a Renault. And so, like, oh, okay. Yeah, I got me 1993 Renault. Like, oh, what edition? Oh, the Clio Williams. And it's like, that's... 
that's just not a car name, man. That's like a that's just like a name that you would name your car after you unbought it. But it's like, yeah, that's just I don't know. I don't know. This, I don't know about this. What's the horsepower on this? Yeah, 169. This is supposed to be a truck. This looks like some truck where it's just you only take it out in the field to pick out flowers or something. The Helix Arctic Truck Trucks AT38. Yeah, I'm going to have to mod that out because I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Truck like that, you should be, you know, the scariest looking truck. You know, it's 20, um, 2007 Toyota. Well, I was even reading the... Oh, okay, I was reading the names for these cars. And then, uh, yeah, 1962 Triumph Spitfire. That ain't even really a name, too, for a car, but... All right. This car is really... This car is fast, too. This car, I think, yeah, I got this in an, uh, a barn find. So, uh, yeah, it's, it's pretty nice. 1998 TVR, Cabrera Speed 12. Then, uh, last, Volkswagen, 1980 Volkswagen, uh, Scorico, Scor, Scor, I don't know, freaking whatever them names are. Yeah, same thing. Anyways, yeah, that 2011 version. So, yeah, that has been my garage. Uh, if you, if you guys, like, see a car that you, um, would like to see me test drive, I'm thinking about doing that, like, test driving some cars and things, and, uh, seeing how they, uh, how they drive on the road. I should be doing that, like, make a bunch of videos doing that over the weekend and things, but anyways, yeah, I will talk to you guys later. Thank you guys for watching, hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you are new, like and subscribe, stay tuned for some more videos of Forza Horizon 4, and I will talk to you guys later. Thank you guys for watching, and peace.